So we have to combine elements to ruin the earth. Got it. Fire plus earth equals lava. We need more of that. And that adds lava to the world. And I think our work here is done. That's all the world really needs. So now if we want, we can mix that lava with whatever we want on this side, like water. That's going to give us steam and stone, which is probably going to add something to the earth that can be used now or perhaps later. Not to be a stickler, but I feel like there was already lots of stone here on this earth. And since we have stone, let's mix that with, say, water again. What does water and stone create? Sand. Sand is very important for relaxing. It's also very coarse. There we go. We added a bunch of sand to that particular location on earth so people can enjoy it. I suspect if we add sand together with uh, lava that should make glass or something similar to it or it does nothing what about sand and fire that one makes glass i don't know don't know why we need glass yet uh in case we ever do get an advanced form of life they'll probably appreciate the glass until then it's mostly just stupid let's try steam and can we do steam and steam what about air and steam steam and water what if we do fire and water Fire and water creates alcohol. It doesn't really work that way. Don't try it. So far, I've created a beach to sit and drink on with the alcohol in the glasses. So I feel like this is a win. I basically just created a resort. And since we have alcohol, let's just mix alcohol with everything. What happens if we mix alcohol with fire? Does it combust? Energy. It does kind of combust. Energy is actually an entirely new element. So we can combine uh, energy with everything we want. Uh, mostly alcohol. Okay, it didn't want that. Energy and water. Energy and glass. Energy and earth. I don't know what I'm supposed to mix energy with. It doesn't seem to do much yet. Okay, energy and air makes storms. I don't know why we need storms, but we've got them now. So apparently if we create ash, we get a reward, which is probably something like fire and earth or something. But until I'm done mixing alcohol with things, uh, it's going to be a minute. Stone and alcohol? Earth and alcohol. We're going to get the earth drunk. Water and alcohol makes vodka. So now we've got vodka. We're just basically going to make the whole world drunk. Alcohol and fire makes energy. Yes, we already did that one. Now I remember. Well, we need to find out what we mix with vodka. And I'm thinking vodka energy, like vodka Red Bull. That makes the most sense to me. That's where my brain goes. What about a vodka storm? No, it won't let me do that either. Vodka and fire? Vodka and lava. We really got to expand the fire elements. We're not really getting very far here. We already did that. I was thinking obsidian because Minecraft, but I'm stupid, so that makes sense. Uh, what happens if we lava and sand? Lava stone. Lava glass. Lava earth. Lava storm. Lava steam. Lava air. Lava air makes stone. We already had stone. Right, we're completely going in circles now. Okay, now we're getting somewhere. Water and glass makes ice. Ice is going to be a big one because we can make new stuff now. That's probably going to make the northern area pretty cold to keep the vodka cool. And we can create an egg if we're clever enough, but we're probably not going to get there because so far I barely made ice. But ice has got to mix nicely with lava. Ice and water. Ice and vodka. Ice and ice. Ice and alcohol. Ice and air put together turns into snow. That's going to add snow to our world. It's not going to show us doing it though. Okay, we finally found our way to metal using more of the fire that we've been ignoring for so long. Metal is going to be a big one to uh, push things in a more technology advanced direction. Metal and steam turns into a boiler though, so we're definitely getting some technology. We don't have any life, but we do have an all new branch here to work with so we can put things in a boiler. Like vodka. Metal and energy go together to create electricity. Electricity could be handle handy for probably many things okay i want to focus on trying to make ash that's clearly going to be probably lava or fire and something energy and fire makes plasma i'm starting to worry that i'm overlooking something very basic like we're missing the building blocks of life you can't even get hints that tell you stuff like this some of these things may react so it's just a matter of doing them until they do we already had sand what if i create quicksilver i don't know probably metal plus something think i've got it Disables reactions that have already been discovered. Well, that's kind of nice, but we did make Quicksilver, which is technically a liquid. So uh, what's next? What if I create Swamp? Swamp sounds important for life. Somehow I haven't been doing water plus earth this entire time. That makes a swamp. Probably would have pushed us ahead earlier because I feel like it's pretty important stuff. Okay, so we need clay and I've got kind of an idea about that. What happens if we combine earth with earth? Nothing. So some of these may react. Electricity to either, well, one of the waters. Electricity or energy in one of the waters. Energy to quicksilver, electricity to quicksilver. Something's got to happen here eventually. It tells me they're going to react. Energy plus the swamp makes life. Life is suffering. It is when I create it. We're going to be on seeds pretty soon. But we need another hint. We need weeds. That's probably life plus water. Life plus alcohol? No, we'll go for life plus water then. 
that makes sense and we have whatever this is i guess just weeds and stuff so we're gonna add electricity energy and life to weeds nothing's gonna happen but now we can add moss to our stupid world which is probably life plus earth or stone something here well we got the egg didn't expect that one egg is important our first actual creatures our earth is looking pretty good right now so let's give those eggs a drink they've earned it vodka quicksilver what if we throw them in a swamp Something happens if we throw them in a swamp, we turn into a lizard. So we definitely have some creatures running around, but let's try to make some seeds so we can get some plant life, because the lizards probably aren't super happy without it. And we also need dust, which is probably like sand plus earth, wind. Yeah, this entire time I really didn't combine just the most basic of things. But we're going to make the lizards dusty now, so you're welcome. Okay, now if we can combine something with the lizard, we're going to make something new. Probably not any of these, it's probably dust or air. Air and lizard. Makes an air lizard. Oh, makes a bird. That's pretty much the same thing. Those are going to go up there in the North Pole, so I hope they're happy there. I finally made ash. Uh, I thought that'd be easier to make, but that's actually lizard plus fire for some reason. That would technically make ash. It just asked me for that years ago. Now it wants mushrooms, which is definitely life plus something. Okay, while I was messing with that, I put life and sand together. That makes seeds. We're going to grow some sand. Or just seeds human new mission available so all we got to do is make human so i'm going to put life and seeds together and see what that does and then we'll take it from there one life and one seeds that didn't do anything life and life life and energy life and electricity life and egg oh i make coffee and this one's super important i think that was energy plus seeds and good news some of these may react to each other dust and seeds life and ash ghost we haven't even killed anyone yet. We don't even have humans yet. How can we have ghosts? Starting to get a lot of categories. So it groups 10 of 26 and 31 of the 249 elements. We've got a long ways to go to complete our earth. Okay, now it wants a turtle. So I'm assuming that's like life and water. Life and swamp. Bacteria. Well, bacteria is important for many reasons and it's also pretty damaging for others. So if you put weeds and earth together, you get mushrooms. And that's something it really wanted. So now we got mushrooms. We're getting so much diversity here. We have seeds, swamp, mushrooms, and lava. And glass. Next to one's a thunderbird. So I guess electricity and bird? That's not even right. I don't know what a thunderbird is or why that didn't work. What if I create beast? Well, tell me how to do it and we'll create you a beast. Coffee ghost? The hints have been recharged. Some of these may interact. Oh, I made a dinosaur. We still haven't got people, but we do have a dinosaur. And it's a big one. It's going to hang out in the ocean. Uh, also, we still have bricks. Maybe we should focus on that because we've had bricks since the beginning. Okay, never mind. We have a dragon we can make. I'm pretty sure it's going to be dinosaur plus fire or something to that effect. Dinosaur, fire. Yeah, that one's so obvious that it's too easy. So basically now we have a world where there's just a bunch of dragons and vodka. Now for our next hint, some of these may react. Kind of would like more life. Life is kind of fun to play with, but I don't think we're going to get life. Going to be something else. The seeds in the earth was probably an obvious one I shouldn't have overlooked so far. So we have tree. So next we're going to try tree and fire to see what that does. Those definitely combine to make ash ash coal. Once we finally get humans, they're going to be super stoked because I've already basically done all the work for them. They just need to inhabit the world. It's asking for palm trees and I'm assuming that's tree and sand. Okay, palm tree plus vodka really should have been something alcohol plus palm tree well i guess the palm trees are on their own okay so finally the boiler can be in use and i'm assuming it's coal because coal is the new one coal plus boiler equals steam engine we should add some steam to that probably this makes energy so we've managed to create a steam engine before we've even created humans steam next is asking for a treant um that's probably going to be tree plus life or something to that effect yep so we have dragons and dinosaurs and imaginary creatures but still no humans now it's asking for well it asked for oil and phoenix i'm pretty sure phoenix is going to be fire bird something to that effect more mythical creatures i'm pretty sure oil is just going to be dinosaur plus time dinosaur plus lava Dinosaur plus meteorite. Going back for another hint, because I can't quite figure this out. There's too many options. Something there combines with something there. I'm pretty sure bacteria can be turned into lots of things. So there we go. We also have a new mission for ceramics. Still looking for the human part of all of this. Maybe there's something to do with bacteria and life. Bacteria and plankton makes fish. So that one's kind of interesting. There's a school of fish. Uh, our evolution is slowly but surely coming along. What if I create whale, but how? Well, I'm thinking fish probably plus even fish. Fish plus dinosaur, uh, fish plus life. That didn't work either, so I'm not really sure what to do about fish yet. 
give it lots of plankton. Whales eat plankton, so I guess that makes sense. I think it's got a blue uh, rim, that means it cannot be turned into anything else. So the whale might just be as good as it gets. Sulfur, that's going to be something volcanic, probably plus sand. But also we can combine some element here with an animal to create something. Stone whale. No, whale's blue, it can't do anything. Metal dinosaur. Ooh, an aquarium. Nope. Uh, I'm not actually sure what to make of this. I think that was s s sand and, and lizard. I don't even know what I just put together, but I made a beast. So the beast can still be mixed with things. I'm just not really sure what. Do oh, beast plus life equals human. Oh, we're gonna mix humans with everything. I want some weird stuff to happen now. I like how they put the human isolated over here away from anything useful. We can definitely make a wizard. Human plus energy, maybe? Well, that was a pretty good guess. That's also pretty weird. Um, human plus steam engine? Boiler? Wizard plus steam engine. Oh, human plus coffee. Human doesn't actually interact with coffee, so this game is not realistic at all. Okay, but humans plus something here certainly do, and I'm thinking that's vodka. Alcoholic! We've had humans on this planet for 30 seconds, and already we've got alcoholics. But, like I said, they're sitting on the sand under the palm trees having a tropical vacation. Imagine getting a wizard drunk? The stupid things they would get up to. What about a wizard and a ghost? Dragon? Wizards like all these things. Can we just feed humans these things then? Alcoholic can be combined with something. Wait. That actually worked. Ash dragon? Don't really know what the point of that was. What if I create sex? We probably get more humans if we do that. But that's how we do it. Now domestic animals are probably going to be humans plus animals of some kind. Human plus beast equals domestic animal. A lot of these are very intuitive. Some of them not so much. But at least he has cows to play with now. Now it wants blood. I feel like we probably should have invented that before the humans. I'm kind of thinking human plus life on that one. Human plus energy? Human seed? Human egg? It also wants meat and I'm pretty sure that's going to be domesticated animals probably with humans. Humans and everything make everything. And we got milk. That actually made a bunch of things uh, because of course they do. Meat and milk are the end of the line though. So what if we happens if we like wool and do that to it? Nothing. But we're back here to combine things with things to see what happens. Probably bacteria. Bacteria can probably mix with many things. Or I'm entirely wrong. It was plankton and rock to make shells. Not sure what the point of that was, but we now have shells. And we're back to Thunderbird again. But I'm really not sure how to do that. Maybe a bird in a storm? Yeah, that was actually it. I tried bird and uh, electricity earlier because Thunderbird and that didn't work. Now it wants a demigod, so that's definitely going to be human plus something. Human plus wizard? Human plus alcoholic. I think that was wizard plus electricity or wizard plus energy. Whatever I just supercharged a wizard. That's all I know. And demigod can still go higher. So what do we combine a demigod with? A human? Oh, an alcoholic. What if I create a corpse? A corpse sounds great. I just don't know how to make one. Uh, oh, alcoholic plus vodka. That's got to make a corpse, right? Alcoholic plus alcohol? No. Well, we're going to do something with the human. Demigod plus quicksilver. Philosopher's stone, which... It's probably actually pretty useful. That could probably turn all sorts of things into all sorts of things. I don't remember how it works. I think it's lead. But I'm thinking human plus stone for tools. Nope. That makes a hut. But we probably do human plus metal, human plus glass to make other things. I feel like for the next little while it's probably going to be the human show. Because they're probably capable of making many, many things. But at least the humans have something useful to work with now. Still going to make a corpse. Not really sure which one of these is going to create a corpse though. Maybe something poisonous. Something here can be combined. Probably the Philosopher's Stone because I haven't tried it with anything yet. Oh, so we got gold now. Okay, humans plus dinosaurs equals blood somehow. Finally got the blood, not sure what to do with it. Human plus blood makes vampire. Maybe vampire plus person uh, makes corpse. Vampire, human. Does something. Okay, this makes another vampire. Oh, poison. We can make poison somehow. That's probably how you get a corpse. I just don't really know how you make poison. Probably mixing something with water. Okay, mixing something here is probably going to make something interesting because we have fire plus water. It's probably going to be coal because I don't think I've tried coal with many of these. Coal and water. Oil. I bet if we combine oil with humans, we get war. Now, where was oil? Oil plus humans actually makes nothing. What do we combine oil with then to make something? Ooh, animal combinations. Oh, lizard lizard. Makes egg lizard lizard. Ooh, weapon sounds interesting. Um, I'm wondering if that's like tools plus metal? Yep, that seems to work. Now humans plus weapons gotta be something. Uh, weapons plus human. Hunter. Now hunter plus animal. The ball's really rolling now. Hunter plus any of these? Beast. 
Blood, meat, and wool. Well, we already had those, but it's a different way of getting there. But we could try hunter against vampire? Dragon? Ash and dragon. We're still only like a quarter of the way through the elements. That's bananas. Maybe hunter plus weapons equals soldier or something? Yes, it does. Warrior. But what do we do with a warrior? Make him hunt more things? Oh, maybe he can defeat the dragon. Makes blood and a hero. So then what happens if we do vampire and blood? I think that would just make him happy. Kind of want to see what else we can do with the warrior, but it's not looking like much yet. Warrior plus human. There's the corpse. We get blood, corpse, warrior. 400 trillion years of evolution. All to a mountain of corpse. But for some reason we can combine the corpse with something. So maybe bacteria? Maybe feed it to animals? Corpse? Corpse. Okay, some of these may react. We're going to get something mythical combined with an animal. We're probably going to get some kind of new mythical creature. So we're going to try and make a new fish creature. Fish ghost? Fish dragon? Fish vampire? Lizard vampire? Okay, it's something to do with the dinosaur because nothing else mixed. Nope, I've just clearly overlooked something. I'm pretty sure blue means they can't go any further. Oh, is beast and vampire makes a werewolf because of course it does. Still looking for clay. Okay, we're back to the uh, hint again and I'm pretty sure tree is the only thing we can use. So tree tools makes wood. Wood can probably be used for so many things that I hardly know where to start. Wood and fire maybe makes energy. Ash and coal, basically energy. Also just realized you could probably use humans in wool or something in wool to turn that into different stuff. Clothing perhaps? Or maybe not. So I think the philosopher's stone and wood just made a tree. So maybe I should be using the philosopher's stone more to like create life out of stuff. Philosopher's stone and water made beer. So we better combine the beer with the alcoholic to see what happens. And nothing. Okay, so the next hint is some of these things react. We got a lot of blue. We got some blue on there. So we'll just keep combining until we find what we need. I don't think it's going to be humans. I'm thinking maybe wood plus tools will make something. That's the wheel. So I think with wheel and energy, wheel and something, technology could probably turn into vehicles or something rudimentary vehicles. Wheel plus steam. Might need some more advanced technologies before we're going to be able to use the wheel on something. It's asking for a cart and that might be wood plus wheel. Yeah, that might be more the framework for a vehicle, but we could probably also put stuff in the cart. So from here, we're going to have a lot of options. Let's try wood plus, I don't actually know, ice, refrigerator, alcohol, cup, boat. I'm suspecting it's probably going to be blood in something or maybe the philosopher's stone will make something come to life. So far, I've been wrong almost entirely. So now I can't help but wonder if it's the seeds. There's so many options. You just never know what's going to react with what. I found the turtle. Uh, it was egg plus sand equals turtle because of course it does. It now wants me to create moss. So I'm wondering if that's weeds plus tree or one of the bacterias. Nope. We can also do a ship, which might be boat plus wood, which is definitely odd. We just add more wood and we get a ship. That's fine. But now can we go ship plus any of these like a steam engine? We can steamship and that's about as far as you can go with the steamship but we have the wheel we might be able to combine with metal also some of these elements may react uh it's probably not going to be the vodka but i'm going to try the vodka anyway uh we found moss that was swamp plus weeds now we can make a car so it's probably going to be similar to how we made the ship we'll try wheel plus basically everything and that's not working we might be a few steps away from the vehicle i don't know what else it's going to take maybe human plus the wheel human plus the cart well the hint is recharged and i'm gonna like whatever these turn into i'm just not sure which one we're gonna need to go with maybe bacteria i managed to make poison i didn't really even see what happened there it was just rapid firing things not sure why we need poison but we definitely have it and we can make a corpse trillions of years of evolution and 79 elements and we mostly managed to create a corpse